So it's day five of our PlayStation memories. PlayStation turns 20 this week and we're looking back at our favourite, most memorable experiences with Sony's original console. This is day five. Yeah. And it's your pick, Gav. It is, yeah. And I've gone for Parappa the Rapper, mostly because I wasn't allowed to have Resident Evil because we'd already been picked. <laughs> but for me, like, yeah, Parappa the Rapper will always hold a special place in my heart, I think, because it was just one of those games where I'd never played anything like it before. It's so weird and so odd. And when you're trying to explain the concept to however old I was at the time, I just sort of couldn't get And like, it was just such an odd game. But for some reason, even though I didn't get what was going on, I clicked with it and I was really, really good at it. All right, try and explain it to me right now. That's the thing, I can't. It's about a kid, I think, who's being bullied and he's trying to learn well, at the beginning, he's trying to learn some kind of kung fu, but it's also like a rhythm, action, dance game, but you're a rapper. I mean, that's really hard to explain, isn't it? I think it also summarises what was really cool about the original PlayStation. In a, yeah. game, in a world now dominated by AAA blockbusters, yeah. back then it was really interesting to stumble across curiosity games. Definitely, Because it was yeah. also before the internet to a large extent. Yeah. And uh, I didn't have the internet until like the late no. 90s. And this was like this weird, curious game from Japan. And yeah. All the crazy. Well, that's the thing, and I think like my the game that I had with my PlayStation was Independence Day, which I hated and I was terrible at. But I had Demo One, and this was on Demo One, which had like Abe's Odyssey, this that other like musicy game, and I played this to death, and I was so good at it, the demo. But my sister just couldn't do it, and I used to make her cry all the time, just taking the piss out of it because she couldn't do it, and I could. It's quite sad, but I mean, you know. You like you like the flat two D, three D. Yeah, stuff. it is really good. And then when they tried to do Parappa the Rapper two. In like full 3D, it just doesn't have the same kind of charm. Sure, no. Like, this just looks mad. Why has he gone away? Like, he's seen yeah. so much goodwill towards Parappa, and it's yeah. never come back. It's crazy, isn't it? Do you think he'll come back on PS4? Do you well, want hopefully. him back? Yeah, I'd love to see him back, but in exactly this style. Like, not, like, don't mess around with him, don't make him 3D, don't make it a gritty reboot. <laughs> Like I think it'll make it a first-person rapper game. Oh, no, first person. Imagine that. That'd be terrible. I can't have that. No, leave it as it is. So that was your pick, Gav, Parappa the Rapper. Your favourite, most enduring PlayStation memory apart from Resident Evil? Apart from Resident Evil, yes it is.